pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Open public meeting statement act, please. Pursuant to the Open Public Meetings Act, adequate notice of this meeting was forwarded to the official township newspapers posted on the bulletin board and township website on July 16, 2021. This meeting is being videotaped and will be on Channel 9. Roll call. Mr. Deegan? Yes. Mrs. Here. Pesh Wilson? Yes. Here. Mrs. Blaine? Here. Mayor Bruno? Yes. Mr. Doyle's absent. Hey. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm here. Mary, correct me. <laughs> Motion uh, open the first public portion for resolutions and ordinances below. Oh, this is the first one you guys say. Dave, you want to make the motion? Oh, second? Oh. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so drugged up here. <laughs> whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> well, pain medicine, excuse me. Um, I make a motion we go into the first public portion. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Just checking. <laughs> can I get a motion to close the first public portion for um, resolutions and ordinances below? I make a motion we close the first public portion. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Can I get a motion to approve resolution R12521? Awarding contract to Jersey Professional Management. I make a motion that we approve R-12521. Second. Mr. Deegan? Yes. Mrs. Pesh Wilson? Yes. Mrs. Flame? Yes. Mayor Bruno? Yes. Can I get a motion to approve resolution R-12621, accepting the resignation of Brandon Umba as Township Administrator and naming an interim acting Township Administrator? Uh, great regret. I uh, make a motion. We approve R2621. I'll second. Mr. Deegan? Yes. Mrs. Pesh Wilson? With regrets, yes. Mrs. Flame? Yeah. Mayor Bruno? Yeah, I'm over this guy. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get a motion to approve R12721? Support from local governing body authorizing sustainable communities grant. Application funded by Land City Electric. To make a motion that we approve R12721. I'll second. Mr. Deegan? Yes. Mrs. Pesh Wilson? Yes. Mrs. Flame? Yes. Mayor Bruno? Yes. I get a motion to introduction of the following ordinance public hearing on August 10th, 2021. Ordinance is O1221, establishing the salaries and wages of municipal officials and employees of the Township of Franklin. I make a motion that we introduce O1221. Second. Mr. Deegan? Yes. Mrs. Pesh Wilson? Yes. Mrs. Flame? Yes. Mayor Bruno? Yes. Okay. Mr. Mayor, just for the record, that that uh, ordinance was a cleanup due to um, a review of when we were putting together the budget. Um, principally, you'll see that section two and section three um, were separated out um, under the old ordinance. You had a section two that uh, stated salary ranges and hourly ranges for part-time individuals. However, when you look at your hourly rates, there are several employees that are full-time that receive an hourly rate and are not salaried um, that are under the full-time designation. And then with the audit of what people are currently making uh, for their contracts or resolutions passed by the governing body, several employees were over the expenditure that the range would allow. So in order to correct that before the end of the year, my recommendation to the committee was to uh, pass this ordinance. Thank you for clarifying that. Thank you. So we have a motion. Do we have a second? You already approved it. I just did it. We didn't yeah. really approve it, but um, can I get a motion to open the second public portion for any comments? I make a motion we open the second public portion. A second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Harry Kennedy, 1578 Fries Mill Road. Uh, the contract with the uh, managerial company, Mr. Mayor, will that provide uh, for certain positions for the township uh, enumerated yes. in that resolution? Yes. There's, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Brandon, there's four individuals that will be coming in. Uh, so my, my recommendation to the committee 
was one that a local employee be named the interim um, acting administrator that was done uh, under resolution 126-21 um, and then under this proposal it is a multi-phase proposal you only authorize phase one that is allowing for four individuals of this company um, two of those four individuals served as certified municipal finance officers or CFOs um, of towns and um, two were municipal managers slash administrators um, they bring about over a hundred years worth of experience between the four of them um, and they will be reviewing the township's operation uh, from various departments to make corrective uh, proposals to the town moving forward and that would be phase two and then if there's a need for phase three that uh, you would go from there so the uh, professional management uh, will be more or less what we did a long time ago which was get a an audit at that time it was offered by the state uh, to do a thorough audit of all the practices of the township as to see what was efficient inefficient appropriate inappropriate I would guess that's what you're going to do I'd say you're going to look correct. at every nook and cranny financially and uh, administratively uh, get a good personnel look. everything good idea uh, do you have a cost for that, uh, Mr. Mayor? I believe Mayor? it was just under the threshold, Brandon. So 17, 17,475 for phase one. It's pretty good for 100 years of experience. That's less than 10 cents an hour if you get good work out of them. But in any case, uh, good. Uh, who is the interim uh, uh, administrator going to be? Barbara. How about that? Very good. It's, just a re it's, it's Brandon's recommendation. They want someone on site right. that's going to be able to work with them Specifically within the, the proposal, there was a recommendation um, after several meetings with myself for Barb to be named the acting uh, temporary administrator. Um, there also is a caveat in there that I would make myself available within the, the during the four week review for telephone and Zoom. My tenure with Franklin will end on Thursday, um, and there will be no cost for my services during those four weeks when I'm being called for my advice and other uh, input very generous of you I'm sure that zoom will be in uh, in great shape uh, Barb as the uh, interim administrator is uh, fascinating choice I'll save my discussion uh, more thoroughly for the next meeting we'll talk about uh, her tenure and counting petitions we'll talk about some other things that I think might cause a problem and we'll also talk about John Salvatore's analysis of Barb's work when he was here. But we'll save that for the next meeting, Mr. Mayor. It's such a pleasant meeting, I wouldn't want to interrupt it with anything unpleasant. I appreciate that. You're Mr. quite Mayor. welcome. You take care and have a nice night. I will. Thank you. Okay. You as well. I get a motion to close the second public portion for any comments. I make a motion that uh, we close the second public portion. All in favor? Second. Oh, yes. Oh. Aye. 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 Uh, can I get a motion to adjourn? I make a motion that we adjourn. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye.